Hi friends, I am Ashu. Today we will see how to configure Gmail in Lotus Notes. Uh, let's start. Starting. Uh, this is because none of email account is configured in my Lotus Notes. So whenever I'll start my Lotus Notes, it will show like this. Here we'll simply click on next. Here you can see it's it's asking for uh, your name. So I'll give a valid name for my Gmail ID that is test practicals. And here because I don't have any Domino server, so we will uncheck this option. Uh, we are configuring a Gmail, so that's why we will uncheck it and click on next. Uh, we are not using any instant messaging so I'll uncheck this option and click, simply click on next yeah. here in this window we will select the option internet mail servers or for IMAP and SMTP now I'll click on next here uh, in this option we'll click on it and select IMAP option incoming internet mail uh, mail and uh, incoming mail server will be imap dot gmail dot com and click on next here here you have to type your full email id that is test practicals at dot com then your password Again your password and here you will see the option log on using SSL secured circuit layer option so if we have to check tick on this uh, checkbox and click on next now it will ask for the outgoing internet email so our outgoing internet mail server is smtp dot gmail and click on next now here simply type test practicals at the rate gmail.com and our internet domain is gmail.com because our email id is in gmail so i'll type gmail.com and click on next edition node setup is complete so i click on ok and uh, my lotus nodes will start and it will show its own page here yeah you can see my Lotus Notes is started here. Here we have option. You can see uh, this open window, open button. Sorry. So here I'll click on contacts. Uh, yeah, this is the contact window. So here we click on advanced setting. Under advanced you will see the various options like account various account names so here we have to double click on this incoming internet mail uh, once you open this internet mail uh, account incoming internet mail here you will see the various options like account server name login name and password and these options uh, we have to go to this tab advanced uh, here we will go to this option advanced and uh, we will click this option edit account and we have to change two options here uh, like this accept XSL site certificates we will click on yes and this SSL protocol version we have to change it to v3.v3.0 
3.0 with 2.0 handshake and uh, port number is already there which is right so we will simply save and close it now we will go to this option outgoing internet mail we'll open it by double clicking and uh, here uh, login name and password is not there so we we'll click on edit account and type up our type our login id and uh, password and our password we have to change this option ssl from disable to enable here and again we we'll go to the advanced tab and here again we have to change these options SSL site certificate to yes and uh, sorry, SSL protocol version 2 v3 with, with 2.0 handshake and port number is which is right here so we will simply save and close it now we have done with these two options incoming internet mail and outgoing internet mail now we will click on the location which is the left side so once we click on it and on the right side it will show the various locations that are already there in our lotus nodes so we will click on online and double click on it uh, online setting for online uh, location is open so you can see our location is local area yes location name is yes our mail id this everything is ok here so we will click on servers here nothing is there so we will click on edit and our home mail server is imap.gmail.com and uh, everything is ok and we will go to the ports here please keep one thing in mind that this, this TCP IP option should be tick here never uncheck this option go to the mail yeah uh, we will change uh, certain values here like mail by location it is on, on servers we will select local and uh, domino mail our domino mail domain is gmail.com and uh, after that send outgoing mail we have to change this option directly to internet because we are not using any domino that I already told you so we will simply change directly to internet now settings are done here and nothing here in the application yes this is what you can do whenever you want we will click on this application and uh, I want immediate reply replicas when you want to replicate your mails lotus not mails with the gmail uh, you have to click on this option and yes replicate i don't want that lotus not should prompt me so i'll keep this option and if you want to schedule the replica that after a fixed interval of time it should automatically replicate with the server so we have for that option we will click on this option and it is replicate between this is the time limit whenever you want uh, this uh, lotus nodes will automatically replicate with the server between this time limit and repeat in every it is 60 minutes so i'll change it to 5 minutes because you may get any mail in any interval of time so i'll put uh, 5 minutes here more to do here yes and uh, nothing to do with these options so I'll simply save and close this yes it is done so I don't need to do anything else from here now we will again click on this open and here you will see the option replication 
I'll click on here and I click on this option start now because to download my mails from the server I need to replicate so I'll click on start now here you can see my mailbox is showing now uh, this is my inbox and all of my gmails gmail that the mails that are in inbox are showing here uh, you can see like this so you can see that and uh, these are the various folders i'll expand this gmail These were my sent mails, and these are my inbox. So, I think this uh, video will help you, friends. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Bye bye.